Doug. And I'm Kathy. And, and this, this is, is Maggie, Maggie May. May. Join us as we follow the moon. Today, we're at Rainbow Springs State Park in Denellen, Florida. This is a beautiful area as you can see over our shoulders already. It is. But we're gonna walk you through and let you enjoy the day at Rainbow Springs State Park in Denellen, Florida with us. Come along, thank you. Now, Rainbow Springs State Park is a beautiful state park, but it didn't start out that way. It started off as an attraction. It was a privately owned attraction, the springs. And you'll see some more remnants of that as we walk through that. But it was taken over by the state when the attraction closed. Thank goodness for that, because it is a beautiful, beautiful area. It really does depict what Florida looks like. You know, it's just so beautiful. Now this gives you a little bit of a, a map of the grounds. There's a lot of trails to walk, but they are all paved. Um, I would say it would be completely handicapped accessible. We pushed the stroller yeah. and went never had yeah. to never had to take stairs. There were some, but there were ramps around them. And when you first walk in, that's the first thing you see is that view down the hill towards the big swimming area and the color of the water and it's crystal clear. It just doesn't get any more pure Florida nature. They do have a visitor center there as well as a small gift shop. And the flowers were in bloom. Yep. Kathy, you know your flowers better than I. What all were they? The, most of them were azaleas. We did see some camellias, but most of them were azaleas. And it's very well marked with signs. This one showed the waterfalls were to the right, so of course we went to the right. And the uh, most of it is nature when the park was put in as an attraction. There are a couple of man-made falls in there from the attraction, mm -hmm. but everything you're seeing here is, is just the way the land was. Turtles out there. You could look down in the water and see fish swimming. It was just crystal clear. It mm -hmm. was beautiful. Now, azaleas are kind of short-lived, so we just hit the perfect time. We were here early in, in February. Now, Seminole Falls here went back to the days of the attraction. It was dry at this time. A couple of the falls we saw were dry, but several of them were not, and we'll show you those too. flowers everywhere. Now this was an overlook and you had nice scenery going out on the overlook. There were a lot of people there but it's so spread out that you could really just enjoy peacefully walking and yeah, when you pull in, if the parking lot looks full, don't let that fool you because there's a couple of overflow lots there also. If you're, if you're in an RV, those overflow lots were way generous enough to park an RV in. In fact, there were a couple of RVs there. Uh -huh. But once you're out on the overlook, this is the view you've got. And it's not just swimming over there, but you do see people on stand-up paddle boards, you see them on kayaks, and you can also rent paddle boards and kayaks mm -hmm. there by the hour or by the day.
This is actually a perfect time to get out and wander in nature in Florida. Now, if you see those couple light colored spots there, you can watch them bubble. And that is water coming up through that sand and feeding the spring. All right, first time I ever saw that was at the- uh, Kitty Kitchi. Yeah, mm -hmm. Kitch Itty Kippy. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, I'd never seen that before. And then we had it right here. Now this is another one of the waterfalls. It's always nice as you're walking along, you can hear the water in the distance. Yeah. Now this is a little brick walkway that goes up to another fall. And this is just the small one on the way up. And that's what's feeding it. Isn't that pretty? Yeah. And again, it is, there are inclines to it. It's not as flat as what you think of Florida being in a lot of cases, but it is a very easy walk. It's very accessible. Yeah. And some of the trees are pretty huge. Mm -hmm. There was one and I didn't get a picture of it that was just full of holes all the oh, way up yeah. and down it. And I don't know if it was the insects that did that or the woodpeckers looking for the insects. Probably a little of both. But from those uh, falls, we went on back through the nature trails. I believe there's around three miles of trails here. And we came out where we saw this round structure. And this was their old zoo complex from when this was an attraction. And they're still standing. No, no animals kept in it now, but. Uh, they had small things like little bobcats and raccoons and um, I don't know, I remember there was a long list or. Now this part is right behind the zoo and it's got picnic tables set up that if you wanna come back to that point and have a picnic and then make the loop back around towards the front, you can or you can go on back. But it's, it's just a beautiful walk, a beautiful park. We're coming back around now, back up towards the front. We're looping back around and at the very front is where you can go to the other side of the water. And we'll show you that here in just a moment. These flowers were so pretty. I think the big draw for this is the swimming mm -hmm. and the water, getting in the water. That is Florida. Yeah, isn't that beautiful? Yeah. And people, just laying up there on the hill in the sun. Mm -hmm. It was a gorgeous day. And what a beautiful place to spend it. There are signs up to beware of gators. We didn't see any. No, we didn't. But isn't that pretty? Well, Kathy, what did you think of Rainbow Springs State Park? I love this place. Am I allowed to say the same thing over and over and over? <laughs> you certainly are. This is fantastic. Especially when you're right. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's a beautiful park. It's a great place for a nice walk. Uh, I'd heard the trails go up to three miles in length, and uh, but everything around the springs and the falls and everything we did probably were within a mile. Yeah, there's short walks, but it's beautiful. And it's all paved, so it's handicapped accessible. I don't think stroller. there were any stairs that you had to take. No. So with that, we want to thank you all for joining us today. We hope you enjoyed the park as much as what we have. If you did enjoy, please leave us a thumbs up. We certainly appreciate it. 
And if you haven't already subscribed, please subscribe and ring that notification bell. That way you'll know when each and every one of our videos come out. And thank you for following us as we follow the moon. Thanks for watching today. If you haven't already, please subscribe to our channel. And be sure to ring the notification bell so you'll know when new videos come out. Don't forget to follow us on social media too.